Hello mga kids, welcome back to Mathematics Basics, Second Quarter, Week 3, Lesson 1. Learning Competency finds the percentage or rate or base in a given problem. Before we proceed to our topic class, let us have first a short review. Answer the following question below. Change the following fractions to decimals. Number 1, 35 over 100. What is your answer? Very good. 35 hundredths. Number 2 question class. 7 over 100. What is your answer? Very good. 7 hundredths. Number 3 question class. 45 over 100. What is your answer? Very good. 45 hundredths. Let us proceed to our topic class. Finds the percentage, base, and rate in a given problem. What is percentage? Is the number taken from the base and its form after the word is. What is base? Represent the whole and its after the word of. What is rate? Is expressed in a percent with a percent sign. Good morning class, this is our lesson about percentage, base, and rate. Okay, this is the process on how to solve problem involving percentage, base, and rate. We use the triangle method P, B, and R. If we are going to find the value of percentage, we use the formula B times R. Baka nagtataka kayo paano nakuha yung P equal to B times R. Ito lang yung class. P, looking for percentage, B times R. Next, if we're looking for base, base, pakpan lang natin, yung P, divide over rate. Or B equal to P over R. Okay, if the problem is rate, R, P over B. R equal to P over B. Example number 1 class, we find 75% of 120 is what number? And then, next question class, paano natin malalaman kung yung problem is percentage, base, and rate? A. Our P or percentage is associated with the word And then, our base is associated with the word of and our rate, syempre, alam na natin, percent. Okay. Again, let us go back to our problem. 75 of 120 is what number? Okay. To identify, this one is the rate. 120 this one the base of what number is we are looking for the value of P therefore we use the formula P equal to base times R P equal to base times R P equal to base we have 120 times 75 or we transpose the 75 percent to decimal it becomes 0 0.75 okay p equal to multiply our answer is 90 our final answer class 90 therefore 75 of 120 is what number equal to 90? Our next example class in percentage base and rate, we have 45 is 30% of what number? Again, we use the triangle method okay, to find what kind of problem is this. This is our P, our base, 
and of what uh, again sorry rate and then this is our base okay we find the value of base we use the formula b equal to p over r substitute the value b equal to p 45 over 30 percent or 0.30 then our b is equal to 40 divided by 30 hundreds our final answer 150 therefore 45 is 30 percent of what number equal to 150 Another example class on how to find percentage, base, and rate. We have 35 is out of 120 is what percent? Okay, again, we use the triangular method P, B, and R. Okay, how to identify if this problem is percentage, base, and rate? Okay, this one is our P or percentage and then of our base and then we are looking for percent or rate okay this is the formula to find the rate r equal to p over b r equal to p substitute the value 35 and then our b equal to 120 r equal to okay we are going to Move this one into two decimal places, one, two. It becomes one and twenty hundreds. We're going to divide thirty-five, divide one and twenty hundreds, it becomes twenty-nine and sixteen percent. Okay, that's all for today class about percentage, base, and rate. I hope you learn a lot. Try to answer, finds the percentage, base, or rate in a given problem. Number 1. What is 20% of 75? What is your answer? Very good, 15. Number 2 question class, 50 is 25% of what number? What is your answer? Very good, 200. Number 3 question class, 30 is what percent of 100? What is your answer? Very good, 30%. That's all for today class. I hope you learn a lot. Always remember that math is fun and easy. Keep safe everyone.